Welcome back guys, we're going for Fungus on Mega Brutal. Fungus is a little bit more difficult because it spreads uh, from country to country much slower than uh, than other diseases. But we have Spore Bursts, <laughs> oh, and they're going to be awesome. So let's do this. We're going with Cytochrome Surge for the DNA boost. We'll go with Darwinist. Uh, now, am I going to go with Darwinist? You know what, I don't think I am going to go with Darwinist. I think I'm going to go with... Um, Base oxidization is kind of nice, but I think we're going to go with genetic mimic just to give us a little bit more time for our uh, for our disease to spread. Let's go with that. Then we're going to go with um, we'll go with terracite because getting into the islands is not a problem. What we want is uh, lots of land transmission, so this is going to help us a lot. We'll go with uh, extremophile for a bonus in all environments. And this is the important one. We're going to go with pathostasis. We're going to be getting a lot of abilities. And this is going to save us quite a few points. So let's do this. Mega brutal. <laughs> oh, love it. Uh, we'll call it Skystorm again because I do love it when it comes up and says Skystorm has destroyed the world. Welcome to Play Geek. You are a fungus. Kill everyone. Cool. Uh, pick a start location. Where are we going to start? Uh, I think we're going to start in... Let, oh, let's start in India again. I, I was kind of tempted to start in Saudi Arabia for just like for just for a change. Yeah, I'll go on. We'll start in... You know what? We'll start in Egypt. Like for a real change. Let's start in Egypt. Crank it up to three times speed. Right, we're starting in uh, Egypt. We are a weak disease, but we're used to hot temperatures. Uh, we are the fungus disease type. Um, it finds it hard to travel large distances. Right. So what we want to do initially is um, is up our severity because we want all those lovely bonus points from spreading to other countries. Oh, ships use um, sterilised cleaning techniques, so we're going to have to get um, water one to counteract that. So what we'll do, we'll go to symptoms. We're going to get symptoms first. So we're going to get rash, sweating and skin lesions because that boosts our severity really well. Also boosts our transmission really well. As well. And we're doing kind of nicely. So we're up to 6.7 points. We'll get uh, coughing. And we'll probably get like one more symptom. That's enough points. We'll get, uh, I think we'll get sneezing. It, sneezing's got the most uh, infectivity. We could go with um, pneumonia. Um, I don't know. I think we'll go with pneumonia. Pneumonia's got a little bit more severity to it. So we'll go with pneumonia, I think. Right, now we need to save up eight points because we are going global, guys, in a big way. So come on, give me eight points. Egypt is uh, is starting to spread quite quickly now. And as soon as Egypt floods, like when Egypt gets up to about this kind of level, we'll get detected. So it's kind of important that we spread fast. Here we go. That's the points that we need. Now we're going to go to abilities. And we're going to do some spore bursts. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. So we're going to get one. Two. Now, if you look, these only cost one point each, and because we've got pathostasis, they don't increase. So we can get one, two, three, four, five, six, and that's only cost us six points. That'll infect six other countries, and then if we take this one in the centre, spore eruption. This will infect another two, three. If you're lucky, maybe even four countries. It only cost two DNA points, so we'll take that one. Right, uh, let's go back. This is the fun bit. I love this bit. Boom! Right, let's see. How many countries did we get? Now, remember, because we've increased our severity, uh, we're going to be getting bonuses from... Um, uh, nice bonus points from each of these. Each one of these should give us two or three. I would be expecting to get three from most of these. So we've got one point at the moment. That's uh, that's only two. That, that's three. That's two. That's... Man, what's that? Two? That's two. That's two. Yeah, we're only getting two from most of these. But you'll get two or three points. Uh, we've got a lot of countries there, which is nice. We've got 25 points to spend, which is very cool. So we're going to go to 
transmission, we're going to get, uh, let's see, we'll get water one so that we can, we can transmit by ships. We'll get, uh, we'll get air one and we'll get, uh, well, am I going to get birds? Yeah, I'm going to go with birds as well. So the upgrade lets um, ships be infected again. Sweet. Now, Egypt is starting to flood, and I said, when it gets up to about, well, well, okay, we got detected a little bit early. New minor disease spreading, cool. So they're gonna start working on a cure. Right, the cyst symptom has mutated. Now, the cyst symptom is down here. That's kind of okay, I don't mind that one. There's no lethality associated with it. Oh, we're getting some nice spread. Oh, don't miss that. Uh, what are we gonna go for next? Let's see. Um, what should we go for next? We've pretty much got all the symptoms that I want at this point. I could pick up something like abscesses, which would be kind of nice, or maybe, maybe sneezing, but I think I'll come back to that. Right now, I'm gonna focus on transmission. I'm gonna get insects to help us out in the, uh, the hot countries. Uh, I'm probably gonna leave it at that. I may come back and get water, uh, water and air too. We'll see. We'll see, I'm not sure. But I'm gonna start working on the abilities. I'm just gonna start getting into the cold countries and the wealthy countries with drug resistance. So, what we need now, Egypt started working on the cure. What we need now is a bit of spread and a few points. Let's go to the world view. Oh, here we go, here we go. So let's get, um, let's get cold one. Help us spreading it, oh, here we go. Nice. That's a nice bunch of points. Let's get into the wealthy countries as well. That will help us get into uh, America and uh, Canada and some of the Western countries. Oh, and look, immediately we get into, uh, I think that was the US. Yeah, that's the US infected. That's nice. We will go with um, Cold 2. Very heavy, very high levels of bird migration expected. That's great for us. We need a few more points. We're on the watch list now, though. Now we should be able to get uh, drug resistance too. That's nice. Cool. Necrosis symptom mutated. Now that one we don't want because um, that would send the world into total panic because of the huge lethality. So we're going to devolve that. Go. We uh, we don't want the world going too crazy. Right at this point, it's a case of um, really sit back and uh, infect as many countries as possible. We need to get down to about eight countries, seven or eight countries. So we're kind of relying on our spread, and it is a bit of a. Uh, it is a bit of a race against the world at this point. Oh, good. Another three. How many left? Oh, we still need another maybe six countries infected. Come on, come on, give me those lovely red bubbles. Right, the world, oh, oh, we just got a setback, ha <laughs> Our genes were manipulated and we set the world back. That was very good news for us. That was a bit of luck. Right, we've got another three. I think we're looking good because we've only got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight countries to infect. <laughs> so now we go to abilities. Uh, we go to uh, spore bursts again. Again, these are only going to cost us one point each. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then this one in the middle, spore eruption. That should infect the remaining eight countries. Okay. Um, this one, we shouldn't need to get this one. But we'll see. Oh, here we go. So, world, eight countries to infect. And, oh, insomnia symptom mutated. So, there's one, two, three, four four, five, six, seven, and eight. That's all eight countries infected. So we have now infected every country in the world, which is, of course, awesome source. What we need to do now is start killing people, like, pretty rapidly. So we're gonna go to symptoms, 
but um, I don't want um, to kill people too quickly. So we're going to give them a little bit of time. So what I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with, um, like, am I going to go? I think I'm going to skip sneezing. I'm going to go with fever. And I'm going to go with immune suppression. Just for now. Now we're going to go to necrosis and uh, total organ failure. Uh, how many points is it for noisy? It's, it's, it's like 13 points. It's quite expensive. So I think at this point, we'll just give it like a few seconds just to get a foothold in these countries that it's just got into. Like Greenland's only got like 35 infected. Right, but we're up to for like 56. So we kind of need to get on with it now. You can only afford like a few seconds. So we'll go necrosis. We'll go total organ failure. That leaves us with 27 points. We'll keep those points because we will need to set the world back at some point. But let's take a look at the world view. And we should be killing relatively fast now. We're racking up the points. We've got 47 points. The world is up to 95% on the cure. So we'll set them back. And we'll do that by going... Now let's see. How much is Coma? Coma's 47 points. That's quite expensive. Uh, we'll go with just a regular genetic shuffle. Cool. So. Come on. Kill, kill, kill. We've... Uh, Mutated anemia, which is nice for us. The world got set back to about 81. But they'll soon come back from that. But we're killing very fast. Right, let's pause it on 98%. We've got 42 points to spend. We'll do another genetic reshuffle. And now they're going to start to suffer. Oh, we've got... Uh, they're up to 96 again. We're up to 39 points, though, so we can set them back one more time and let's see how we're starting to destroy their labs though so we should find that the cure starts to go up a bit slower we're killing which means we get more points let's pause it there we've got 41 points to spend they're up to 96 uh, we are gonna have to do the we're gonna have to set them back we can get coma which would be a nice setback let's take that and yeah we've destroyed over 50 percent of their labs now it's it's, it's gonna be a tight one they're back to 87 percent 94 95 let's see what else can we do we could go with uh, paralysis that's also significantly harder to cure so I think we'll go with that one yeah we'll go with that one set them back even further walking dead symptom combo this is going to be a close one they're at 91% 92 let's have a look out oh dear we've I think we've got them guys there are no healthy people left in the world. And you know what? We've got 13 points to spend. What can we spend them on? Uh, like nothing good. I would have liked to give them the world diarrhea or something. But uh, yeah, we can go with something like... I don't know. Let's give them abscesses. Let's give them a few nice abscesses to die with. Or oh, actually, we could go with insomnia. But you know what? Let's go... Uh, oops. Oh, that, oh, we got insomnia. So, no, I don't want to devolve that. Uh, we don't have enough for paranoia. That's a shame. Uh, we'll go with hypersensitivity. Then. Okay, whatever. And the last few people are going to die. There's a million people left. Skystorm to destroy humanity. <laughs> I love seeing that. 10,000 left and victory! Skystorm has successfully eliminated all life on Earth. How many? Uh, we only got three biohazards. I've got to say, fungus is, um, I think fungus is a little bit tougher than, uh, than virus and bacteria. But I, I think it's massive fun. I love those big spore bursts and uh, like it just like having massive inspection spreads. Well, there you go. We did it in 569 days, which is a little bit slow. I could have maybe been a little bit more aggressive in the transmission and gone for air two and water two. 
because we did have points to spare at the end of the day. So we could have sp sped that up a little bit, I think. I hope you enjoyed that, guys. That's how to beat it on Mega Brutal. I'll catch you for the next one. Peace out.